as Afghanistan continues to face a slump in the economy after the Taliban takeover, the fragile economic growth, which took 10 years to accumulate, has been reversed in just 12 months, according to a recent UN report. It projects that up to 97% of the population may be at risk of sinking below the poverty line by next year. The United Nations Development Programme, UNDP, has said that the Afghan economy has suffered a catastrophic fall in the last year, projecting that up to 97% of the population may be at risk of sinking below the poverty line by next year unless a response to the country's political and economic crisis is urgently launched. According to the UN report that was released on Wednesday, the Afghan economy lost around 5 billion US dollars after the Taliban took control and had a gross domestic product of only about 20 billion US dollars before Taliban took control of the country. The report added that already declining regular economy as opposed to the black market lost nearly $5 billion after August 2021 and is reversing in 12 months, what had taken 10 years to accumulate. As per a UNDP analysis, prohibiting women from working could lead to a loss of up to $1 billion US dollars, or up to 5% of the nation's GDP. The report also revealed a disturbing and consistent pattern of human rights violations by the Taliban in line with the previous findings of the High Commissioner for Human Rights that continue to take place in the war-torn country. The international community has made ensuring human rights, especially rights of girls and women, as key demands for any future recognition of the Taliban administration. Afghanistan's assets, which have remained frozen due to sanctions, have severely hampered banking, business and development, leading to greater insecurity, poverty and isolation.